Nelson Chamisa's Citizens Coalition for Change CCC, has lambasted Nangagwa's ZANU-PF government after a Zimbabwean national was stoned and burned to death by South Africans in Deepslut, Johannesburg. In a statement, CCC spokesperson Fidzei Mahir said the late Elvis Nyathi was a victim of the forced migration crisis caused by the bad governance of ZANU-PF. Mzimbabwe News presents the statement below.7 April 2022. Justice for Elvis Nyathi. The Citizens Coalition for Change strongly condemns the murder of Elvis Nyathi, who was stoned and burned to death in Deep Sloot. Johannesburg earlier today. We extend our sincere condolences to Mrs. Nyathi and the entire family of Elvis Nyathi who were tragically robbed of a husband, father, friend and loved one. Zimbabweans woke up to horrific images of a pile of ashes, ashes that were the remains of our fellow citizen, killed for no reason. His murder was avoidable, Horrific and Nyathi was a Zimbabwean citizen who was a victim of the forced migration crisis caused by the bad governance of ZANU-PF. Having settled in South Africa to seek a better life, he has become the tragic victim of the indiscriminate door-to-door -door raids by a vigilante group that targets African foreign nationals outside the confines of the law and without due process. There is no room for a barbaric murder of this nature in a constitutional democracy. The murder of Nyathi is a regrettable affront to Ubuntu and a direct violation of Article 5 of the African Charter on Human and People's Rights which binds the whole continent and provides that every individual has the right to the respect of the dignity inherent in a human being and to the recognition of his legal status. All forms of degradation of man including cruel, inhuman or degrading punishment and treatment are prohibited. We call for the immediate arrest and prosecution of the perpetrators to ensure that justice is done. We further call for the de-escalation of the anti-immigrant rhetoric by public figures and shadowy groups who are fomenting the abuse, extortion, and violence against African nationals. The death of Elvis Nyathi is a stark reminder that ZANU-PF has failed the citizens of Zimbabwe. Citizens like Elvis Nyathi have been forced out of Zimbabwe because of man-made poverty, injustice and corruption. No Zimbabwean should lose their life because they have been driven out of the country by failed leadership. The regime in Harare, has failed in its obligation to serve and protect citizens at home and abroad. Under a CCC government, the root causes of the forced migration crisis will be addressed as a priority, the citizens will be returned to the center of all decision-making, and the dignity of Zimbabwean people will be restored. Fidzei Mahir. National Spokesperson